What's up, Grinders? Relentless here. And I went ahead and went through Realm of Legends last night with Guillotine 2099, and she took every single fight. But one of the fights I was most concerned about, she handled with ease. So I'm gonna show you guys and give you some tips on how to beat Wolverine with Guillotine 2099. Now, as far as it goes, I was running Warlock, Nimrod, Sentinel, Ultron, didn't use them once. Synergies are not that important for this fight, but if you wanna bring them in, you can. Now, as far as it goes, um, I'm gonna make sure she was topped up on health, so you saw me do max health there. Um, I'm gonna put on a few boosts here, nothing too crazy, just a 15% attack boost, 10%er, uh, and another 15%er, you don't need them. As far as it goes, this fight had me a little paranoid. I didn't see anybody do this fight yet. So there was this was actually my very first time. And I do have the full video if you guys wanna check it out. It's about an hour long. Um, but yeah, without further ado, let's get into this fight. Now, the main thing is you wanna start your fight off with a 100 combo meter because of course you're gonna be able to hit harder. The more you hit your opponent, the combo meter grows the more uh, potent your hits are going to be the more damage you're going to do now as far as it goes an aggressive ai helps out tremendously so i hope you guys have some good rng on your ai because if um, they keep attacking into you that's what you want and you'll notice that i throw special twos there because that builds my combo the fastest so that way my hits are a lot more potent now as far as it goes when he gets that regen and he goes up a few times, no big deal. You know, remember, you're building your combo meter right now. So it's important for this Wolverine fight, you want to get it over 200. And then you're going to see a lot of magic happen. But, you know, just bait his specials out as you would. Throw these SP2s to build up your combo meter. And that's pretty much it. And, uh, you know, of course, rule number one in MCOC, don't get hit. Because if you get hit, you lose your combo meter. But if you throw off a couple heavies, you'll get a little bit of a protection shielding um, where you'll notice a yellow icon pop up. You can get up to six of them if you like. Um, but if you want to just handle business and go straight in like this, that's no problem too. If you feel confident fighting Wolverine, his specials are very easy to dex. You can range out of all of them. No projectiles dexting or anything like that. But yeah, pay attention here because this is where it gets real fun. So I'm putting on a lot of the degen, which um, when he procs his regen and whatnot, that definitely helps out. But with that combo meter being as healthy as it is, we're doing some good damage there. Now throwing off these SP2s with that regen that he has right there. Look at that. He's just degening. And I'm going to show you guys my mastery setup as well. So that way you guys can kind of see what I did to tweak my masteries around because that does help tremendously. But as far as it goes, we're at 241 right now. We're beating, beating into Wolverine pretty nice. You know, every time he throws a special or a heavy, we run right in there and attack immediately. We're relentless in this pursuit, pun intended, at 260. He barely has anything left. Um, we're going in there and attacking with everything we got, any opening that we get. That regen is just degening him, and there we go. 270, well, 271 hits. That last hit was kind of a love tap. But as far as it goes, um, it was only 171 hits there uh, since we went in with 100 combo meter already. But as far as it goes, that was it, you know? But uh, I told you guys I would show you my mastery setup, so let's go ahead and take a look at that. Now, the most important mastery for this fight, or masteries, I should say, um, you wanna take a look at this despair mastery right there. It really does help out tremendously a lot, um, especially when he's going through that regen and that degen phase. And then over here, um, I went ahead and maxed out pacify, so his abilities are less likely to proc. Um, and then went ahead and did the stupefy as well. So that way, when you block him and stun him, it'll pause his regen. But that's all I got for you, grinders. I hope you guys had a good time listening to this video, and I hope it helps Relentless out.